Today, Capitol Police arrested a transient from Oceanside who had a machete and a bayonet parked near the Democratic National Committee headquarters in Washington, D.C. As ABC 10 News anchor Vanessa Van Hefty found out, the man has an extensive criminal history in the East and North counties. Around midnight, a special ops officer came across this truck while on patrol, a pickup with a swastika and other white supremacist symbols painted on it right outside the DNC headquarters. The truck had an American flag in lieu of a license plate and animal antlers in the front grill. Inside, the officer found a bayonet and a machete, both illegal in Washington, D.C. The driver, 44-year-old Donald Craighead of Oceanside, arrested for carrying prohibited weapons. He told the officer he was on patrol and ranted about white supremacy. We did some digging at courthouses in the north and east counties today and found Craighead has a rap sheet with various felony and misdemeanor charges. In November of 2020, Craighead was charged in the North County for trespassing and threatening and drawing a knife on another man. In 2019, he was arrested and charged after stealing cigars from a Santee cigar shop. And in 2015 and 16, he was charged with evading officers, reckless driving and possessing illegal drugs. Oceanside police confirmed they cited Craighead in March for a minor infraction, saying he was a transient with an Oceanside post office box. His arrest in D.C. overnight happening while Capitol Police are on heightened security, preparing for potential clashes during an upcoming right-wing rally on Saturday in Washington. Vanessa Van Hefty, ABC 10 News. Well, it's not clear if Craig Head was planning to attend any upcoming demonstration or if he had any ties to previous cases in D.C.